I was a bedside nurse in OB for about nine years and um, decided I needed to get on a role where I could be a better advocate for my patient. Um, I really wanted to make sure I, you know, I would talk about how specific and different uh, labor and delivery especially is compared to the rest of the hospital. There's the first time meeting the patient, especially with a younger patient, um, my goal is to make them not be afraid of coming to the see a provider. My goal is to keep them safe and to educate so that they know preventative care, they know how to take care of themselves, they get any kind of medication or you know help that they need. I like to you know talk to the patient. I always start with, hi, how are you today? And what brought you in? Like, what's going on? Is anything? Do you have questions about anything? And then talk about their goals for the visit, what they want for just not only that visit, but you know, if they were here talking about birth control or pregnancy or trying to conceive or getting ready for menopause or anything at all that they, I know what they want for that visit. First time mothers and you know, parents in general are all very nervous and excited at the same time. They might be feeling nauseous or tired or having, a, you know, a good or bad time with their pregnancy. So I like to give, you know, lots of education, you know, but not an overwhelming amount because that first visit can be a little overwhelming with the amount of education and information to know about. And the best part about OB is that we know that we're going to see them again. Just seeing someone, you know, be educated and empowered to take care of themselves and to know more about their own body and to feel safe with their own self is really you know a good a great part of my job having a really wonderful delivery and somebody getting to meet their baby for the first time of course that's you know right up there at the very top of the coolest things that i get to do every day